Hello, hello, my scrumptious ravens. Welcome to day 168 of the Fixing My Life series. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Raven, and 168 days ago, I decided to try and fix my life. So what that basically means is 168 days ago, I was very upset and unhappy with where I was in my life, and I decided to try and do something about it. So what I did is I created a list of things that were sort of top priority absolutely essential things that I thought that were needed in order for me to make some kind of drastic changes in my life that were essential. Uh, things like, you know, the time I wake up, when I go to sleep, how much water I take in, what I'm eating, if I've exercised, if I've prayed, how much I've prayed, if I read the Quran, things like that. Things that I wanted to start implementing into my life that I wasn't before. And I track my progress with each of those things every single day. And what I do is I create a vlog every single day or every other day, just kind of documenting my progress with those things. And the goal is that by becoming more conscious of each of these things, I hopefully will develop some good habits and drop some bad habits along the way. So that's what the series is about. Um, just let me give you guys a quick update on what has been going on today. Um, I have, in terms of prayers, prayed Fajr, which is the early morning prayer, or I guess before daybreak prayer. And I've prayed Esr, which is the third prayer of the day. I missed number two, which is Zohar the early afternoon prayer, I prayed the late afternoon prayer, which is Usser. So I'm at two out of five for right now. Not too, too bad. Um, in the morning, I had water and dates as per usual. I, I'm going to try my best tonight slash tomorrow morning to have something more sustainable for uh, suhoor. It just gets really hard to eat in the morning because I'm usually quite tired and I don't really make one I don't really the honest truth is I don't want to spend time making food when I could be using that time sleeping um when I lived with my family we would usually have suhoor together as a family and you had no choice but to wake up a little bit earlier so that you can join in and we all all eat together so it's definitely very different right now but I am doing my best and you know what so far the fasts have been going great um, I am human, so there are times where I'm like, mm, my tummy's crumbling, but I know why I'm doing it, and the reasoning behind why I'm doing it just kind of makes it all worth it, and it, I don't really feel it too crazily. Um, okay, so that's food. I've d covered food. I've covered prayers. Um, I have not read the Quran today, but I might read a couple verses of the Quran tonight. I will keep you guys posted. But for right now, I have two hours to kill before, uh, yeah, two hours to kill before it is time for iftar, which is when I break my fast. So I figured, why not be productive? We could, um, get some work done in the washroom. So I have this shower or, um, not shower, this washroom organizer that is begging to be used. So let's get it in the house and clean it up a little bit and get some stuff on it. Oh, by the way guys in case you're wondering what's on my head it's like a microfiber towel that you can just wrap around your hair so that it can dry and um, you don't have to put on a huge towel for your hair to dry so that's what I'm using right now I've got my gloves on and we are going to start cleaning that baby so it was outside because I gave it a fresh coat of spray paint um, it's I didn't spray paint it as well as I thought I did but it's okay. Ugh, it's gonna bug me. I know myself. It's gonna bug me. It's gonna bug me. I need, I gotta go. I'll be right back. I gotta go. Okay, well, that's a change of plans because I thought that I had the organizer completely spray painted super well and I was getting ready to clean it and organize it, but it's drying outside. So I figured, why don't we do the next thing that I wanted to get done, which is this. Um, I had those ugly blinds, remember? And then they started getting stuck at the end. Like, I couldn't move it. And then anytime I tried to pull the blinds, freaking, it was like <laughs> cracking. So I'm like, okay, before I break it, let me just call the super. So the super was super kind and he just removed everything. But now I have a completely exposed window, which I definitely didn't think about. And I sleep right there. 
so it's a little creepy um, with people like possibly watching and I would just feel more comfortable if it was covered up. So what I'm planning to do in the meantime between the time that my um, curtains arrive, I'm just going to use some shower curtains that my mom gave me. And yes, in case some of you noticed, this is the same shower curtain that I used as wallpaper in my other home, my parents' home. So let's get taping. whether to put the cover on. The cover is actually made for two more shelves or one more shelf, but as you can see, I don't have space. So I'm thinking it doesn't look too bad just like that. So I might just leave it like so that. So I wanted to share with you guys this really cool thing. So not this, I just got garbage bags. But I was actually looking for an in, um, in, door in cabinet garbage can for my kitchen and when I was at Dollarama look it was four bucks I got this bag holder with removable lid holds up to 10 pounds so I thought why don't I share this experience with you guys so let me open okay, it okay so this is what comes out it's just this this and this press clips inwards to release the retainer from the base Press the clips inward. What? Press clips inward. Ah! Oh! All right, all right, all right, all right, hold on. All right, so let's grab a clean garbage. Ooh, these are nice bags. Ooh, these bags are nice. Okay, 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 glad. Okay, glad, I see you. Don't get mad, get glad, I get it. Okay, all right, all right, so this is 20. Oh, it's a good size. Okay, well, hopefully it's not too big for my kitchen cabinet. All right, so I've opened it up. Now what do I do? Now I think I slip it in here. I'm just using some logic right now. And then, then I put this on top. Is that right? I think so. Cool! No! And this was a fail. No! What is this? Okay, give me a sec. Oh, I just used two hands and it worked. But, moment of truth, can it close? What, what's it hitting? Oh, the sink, right. Whoops, okay. Tuck that somewhere and then... Okay, let's find something to throw away. What should we throw away? I'm so excited. Um, 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 throw oh, garbage, garbage, garbage. All right. Cool. This is so cool. Oh my God. I love this. Bestest invention ever. I just want to scoot this over a little bit. Yo, come on. This is what I'm dealing with right now. Before, after, yo, oh my god, I'm so, I feel so blessed. Oh my god, this is today's iftar. It is leftover pizza and um, a little bit of spinach and a, like a small bit of a carrot that my mom left along with like other 
other carrots, but I'm like, I just want a little new new carrot. So I took that new new carrot and I just cut it into little pieces and it actually looks so cute. It actually looks really cute. Tell me that doesn't look cute. Okay, ew, is my phone dirty? What, why is it like fuzzy like that? It's probably dirty. Sorry guys, whoops. Hi guys, I'm about to head to sleep, but I thought to myself, why don't I just show you what else I bought today from Dollarama. So, this is the stuff that I'm hoping to set up tomorrow, or use, I guess, tomorrow. Let me show you. So, we've got some bag clips. I feel like these are really, really useful when you have, like, potato bag chips or, like, cookies or something. And um, you kind of just need them sealed. These ones are kind of, uh, yeah, just really helpful to have. So that's that. I haven't really been snacking during Ramadan, so that's good. And then I bought these cabinet shelves. So I only bought one of these because I want to see if it's actually useful. Sometimes these shelves that are supposed to help you organize actually clutter up your space even more. Because, if, you know, everyone's cabinets are different. So I don't know if this is good for my cabinets. And we've already established that I can't move the shelves in terms of uh, like levels so i'll just have to figure out if it works for me here and then i got another one that's longer and i feel like this would be really helpful underneath the kitchen sink because there is a lot of storage down there however it's more tall and deep so i think this that way would be perfect but again, we shall see. And then I got another one. So this is apparently a stackable organizer. It says you can, it's multifunctional. You can use it as a drying rack. How can you use it as a drying rack and the dishes don't fall through? Huh, look. I'm so scared to try this, but I'm also very curious. Yo, I would not trust that. Nope, so rebob. So I'm definitely not going to use it as a drying rack. But if you, you use it as a cup drying rack, that's kind of cool. You could also put plants and shit on it. Huh, I guess. I actually bought it to use in the cabinet. So... Let's see. Again, I just bought these to kind of see if they're going to be useful. That's why I didn't buy multiple of them. And if I see like, okay, this is the one, then I'll buy multiple. But yeah, that's my little haul along with the dish cloths and um, there was like a sponge, the bag clips. Just little things. Altogether, it cost me about $40. But it was all useful stuff. It wasn't um, anything frivolous. I got the garbage thing, I got the glad bags, another um, set of sponges, so all useful stuff. But I'm wrapping up, I'm going to head to sleep soon, it's 2.13, so I should be asleep by well, 2.45 or so. But as always, I'm wishing your heart and your mind and your soul and your spirit and your bad say peace and happiness. It felt so good to wear a nice dress today, dress up a little bit. Even though I didn't put makeup on, I felt pretty. I felt pretty today. I put on some earrings and it was nice to like, I'm usually dressed up like this, like super cash, super cool. But um, yeah, I... I like dressing up so I'm probably going to continue that on most days and yeah you best believe I worked in that dress I did all of this cleaning and all that in that dress and yes I risked getting it dirty but it was fun take care my scrumptious ravens stay safe stay scrumptious and god willing I'll see you all in the next video if I am healthy and able good night and raven out